My name is Gabriel Estrada. I am doing an internship here, uh, Fortune's Practical, and I've been here for like six and a half months already. I'm doing research with Matthias Oita. He's doing his PhD, and it's about detecting the running movement and using the running movement as input in a software, in a, in a watch, in a smartwatch. It has all been done with UAS 7, but this is a new program, so I'm, I'm the first one of this program and it's been a really nice program for me, I'm learning a lot here, German skills and engineering skills in general and also a lot of research skills and how to organize myself into research. I think one, one thing that was very important is working in an environment that's a lab, it is a lab of research and at the same time this environment it's a company. So you are working with the best of the two worlds together. So you're learning entrepreneurship skills and at the same time you're learning research skills. This is really important. And as not just this, soft skills are always super important. And these soft skills are like how to organize yourself while you're researching or how to organize your ideas, how to put your ideas into paper, and how to prototype these ideas into a final product that can be applied in a research or in a person and can change a person's lives or something like that. This is really important and this is something that I'm going to take with me back to Brazil. Everyone should do an exchange program, everyone should try research because probably you don't see yourself in that place yet, but in the future, or after this program, you're gonna see, oh, okay, this is for me, or this is not for me. And this can help you a lot with that. Like, what's, what am I gonna do next? What, what am I gonna do after I graduate? Or do I wanna be on, do I wanna be on research? Or do, do I wanna work for a company or an international company? Or if I want to like be a teacher in the university or this. Personal answers is I wasn't planning on doing masters, like not at all. But after this program, I'm like, yeah, sure. Let's do a master's degree. Let's finish the bachelor's and then do a master's because this used to be common in Brazil and it's not that common anymore. And it's something that like European influence helped me to see that it was important for myself and for myself as a professional to be more complete and to get to know an area more than I learned on bachelors.